What you're looking at right now is a actual working spot drone by DJI. In this episode, we'll get more details. Stay tuned. Hey guys, this is Parak with iRepairMD, and I have to apologize ahead of time for the audio quality. This is a rush video, and uh, time is time sensitive. And what I'm about to show you uh, the new leak images and video of the DJI Spark. And this particular one right here, you see the internal and the outside of the Spark, and it has the black and gray color scheme like the Mavic. This is a leak video from a unknown source at. 5 IMX in China and this is a on demonstration of the 3-axis gimbal you can see the gimbal actually uh, stabilizing in the bottom of the video you can you notice the sensor right there you have the forward-facing obstacle sensor and you have the halo light in the bottom and this is the Mavic drone side by side or top view next to the Mavic the Mavic has, with its arms folded out, is about 50% larger than the Spark. The Spark does not fold. It's a fixed wing drone. or The uh, arms are fixed. And the propeller is significantly smaller. So this is a smaller power drone. Let's go ahead and see some more details. Let's look at the front. What you have is a 80, 180 degrees forward facing obstacle sensing IR sensor, three axis gimbal and camera, the four halo LED indicator, and this is definitely a selfie drone, no doubt about it. This is not set up for racing. Uh, the sensor is large enough to avoid 180 degrees obstacle in front. And now let's look at the inside. You have the Ford facing infrared obstacle sensing cameras. You have the main board cooling fan, which is fairly large. You have the heat sink plate, which channels to the side vents. And then you have the power cable, the motor. The ECS electronic speed control actually exists on a separate board, which is good, easy to replace. Then you have the GPS receiver right center in the middle right there underneath the cooling vent. And then you have the micro lithium cell battery for BIOS setting so you can, you can actually set memories. And let's look at the main board. The main board here has aluminum sheet sh shielding and you have the UP UBS USB connector on uh, the top right right there. And then right in the bottom, you have the micro SD card reader. So DJI is still sticking with the micro SD format. And uh, the shielding is pretty decent. It's uh, insulating it. Let's look at the other vents. You got the six pin battery connector. You see this port here is the USB port and the micro SD card reader port. Real vision sensing camera on the bottom right in the middle and the ultrasonic height sensor is the front a few inches behind in the bottom of the gimbal that's what we have these leaks looks pretty legitimate and um, there's no doubt that this is a close to finish uh, model of the new DJI spark and it will be a step lower than the Mavic drone so now that you've seen the uh, technical specs let me give you my final take and my observation of what might be the performance price range and the availability of this particular drone you're looking at this photo here you see a uh, hand holding on the drone and a folded version of the mavic pro and even when the mavic pro is folded the spark is significantly smaller and it's a lot lighter half of the bottom half of the battery would be taking up most of the carriage space and the two side vents on top with the black enamel i think you might have the two color option the black option and the white option the motor the four motor is about 
20 25% smaller than the Mavic motor and I can assume from that uh, you won't get that much speed the speed you might be looking at is about 15 to 20 miles an hour the since it is a lighter drone it is pretty agile uh, the propeller is a lot smaller than the Mavic and the weight of it is a lot smaller too so the flight time the battery is as far as the size to size to size of the battery to the size of the drone ratio the ratio on the uh, spark is a lot larger than the mavic so i would assume the flight time is 20 to 20 to 30 minutes and the technology that goes into it you're not going to get the light bridge technology like the mavic you go however you will get the real sensing obstacle avoidance you'll have the you'll have the three axis gimbal you'll have the gps locator i don't think it has a radio receiver but i could be wrong looking at the leak internal specs i don't see any slot for the the rc receiver so you're going to be flying this mainly from probably your iphone or maybe even the goggle who knows uh the range of that would be 100 yards and this is a selfie drone or a consumer drone this is going to be the price range is going to be around 300 to 500 dollars i don't see it going above 500 i'll be very surprised if it actually costs as much as the Mavic uh, this spark drone will be a consumer grade catering towards people who wouldn't mind spending over two hundred dollars and this is I think in direct compare uh, direct uh, um, a direct competitor to the uh, to the parent model and this is definitely more stable you can see this there's no moving part except for the propellers so I expect this to be a mass produced drone and you might be looking at maybe this uh, f this fall or maybe late spring hopefully in the summertime but this is definitely going to be a new drone from DJI uh, everything showed shows that it's a DJI product and this is legitimately the next drone that DJI will be pushing out but anyways this is Prack with IRPMD safe repair and safe flying.